All right, let's welcome back to uh, the another problem here. And let's turn on our dimension just real quick to see all of the dimension. We've got 40, 35, um, 28, 25. Um, we're going to start down here. That's why I read out those numbers. This one dimension that we don't know, but we can kind of do it because this one is 40 here. If you look at that 40 and then look at the 35, right? You just subtract that you got five and then so that means the gap right here this little segment right is 2.5 and that is 2.5 so with that information um we can go ahead and start drawing our shapes um we're gonna go and start um here i'm gonna do a 35 here then i'll go up um 10 and then we just did the math for the 2.5 then I'm going to go up 19, then to the right 29, then I'm going to go up 14. At this point, I'm going to go across 100, and then I'm going to go down 14. Um, I'm going to hit escape real quick. I'm going to control Z as well. Oh, control Y to get it back. Um, I'm going to go ahead and hit delete on that last one because I want to. I want to move my shape a little bit. So let me highlight all of these, move it to the right a little bit there. So it doesn't interfere with the, the problem. So here we continue with that, go down 14. Um, and then I'm going to hit escape because we don't know the actual dimension there. What we do know is at this end, I'm going to go up 10. I'm going to go to the left 2.5. Then I go up 19 again, and then this will connect it right there okay um the next thing i'm going to do is i have the 28 by 8 and then 25 by 25 by 23 so i'm going to do those click on line i'm going to go to the center i'm going to go up eight units then i'll do the offset i'm going to offset half of the 28 which is 14. that will give me the rectangle that i'm looking for the 28 by 8 by connecting this right here and get rid of that. Continue with the next level. We're gonna go up uh, 23. I'm gonna offset this half of the 25. So that means it's 12.5. And offset to the left, offset to the right. The escape, what I'm gonna do is just gonna go ahead and connect this right there. And the last one, it doesn't give me the actual height, but it just connected the end there. So I can just offset now is uh, 13, so 6.5, offset left, 6.5, and the right, 6.5. Get rid of those right there. The next thing I'm going to do is I'll look into this section here. What I'm going to do, I'll click on line, um, connect my midpoint there for that. I'll do my offset, okay? Um, I'm going to do two units up, two units down. Now, if you ask me, how do I know that it's right in the midpoint? Well, I don't. I'm just guesstimate. I'm assuming that it is. It doesn't show me anything in the drawing here that it is. All right, this right here now will be my center line. Just want to make sure it is. Uh, I'm going to do one thing here real quick. I'm going to, two is good. I'm going to offset this to the right. I'm going to offset this to the left. I want to um, extend it, my center line a little bit to the to both of those. Oh, I did not offset. Why didn't I offset the other one? All right. Hit escape. Extend it this as well to, to this end. Extend. There you go. All right, get rid of those so it's the center line look nice, okay? Next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to concentrate on drawing this right here. So I got 33 in and 6 down. So I'm going to go ahead and click on line. Then I'll click on that right there. And then I'll do tracking, TR. And then I'll put in 33, enter. Um, somehow, the line is still there. So I'll do... Here, I'll do 33, 
and then go down I'll do six and then I'll hit escape I'm gonna go here and get rid of that um, what I'm gonna do is offset it two units to the right I'm gonna offset it again two unit and then I'll connect it the end here that is now at this point we don't know exactly what kind of angle and things like that for that one so again it's another estimate so we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go offset this one two unit down and then I'll connect it this way to the end point all right now when I'm done with that one thing I'm gonna do I'm gonna extend it this right here one more time and then I'm gonna trim out this part uh oh I want to trim not extend trim out this little section here that I don't need and this will be my construction line my center line I need it to be center line there it is it looked like that okay so the problem is complete let's uh, double check it with some dimension uh, quick check real quick we got uh, that to be a 42.5 not a 42 um, that's a 6 that's a 33 and this is 31 so by doing the problem as you can see um, there's one dimension that is actually wrong in the um, question itself this dimension here um, if we are go back to here this dimension have to be a 42.5 um, it cannot be a, a 42 simply because we follow everything else um, every other dimension that we follow there's nothing and then this end up to be a 42.5 so that is a missing dimension that is need to talk about all right enjoy